go in with my um, foundation. I used Tarte Rainforest of the Sea. This is all natural, organic, vegan water foundation. I love it. I'm running out. I've already put some on, but I'm just gonna like layer some right here. And then I use um, this brush. This is the Expert Face Brush by, um, what is it called? Real Techniques. And I just dab. I don't um, like, I don't know what it's called, swivel. <laughs> And I just put it all over my face really, really fast. But then I go in with a color corrector just because I really have um, dark under eyes. I don't put foundation under my under eyes, FYI. So I just put this color corrector. This is the um, Sephora, I think. Yeah. I used to use a different one, better one, but this one works. So then I go back with the same brush. I'm not really picky. And I just grab that. And I put it on top of my eye. So then I look like this. Okay. Then I'm gonna go with my found, um, concealer. I am right now using the Candid Red Blonde um, Antioxidant Concealer. I really like this one. It doesn't dry out too fast. Like I noticed um, before I was using the um, Smashbox um, Studio Skin Flawless Concealer and it would dry up really, really fast and it would almost crease my eye and under eyes. So was recommended this one and I really loved it for now. I, I'm gonna order a new one though. So for now, I'm just gonna put it right here. Right here, 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 here. Right here. And then I go in with the same brush. Again, this is not my. I'm not being really specific with my stuff right now. And then I just dab, 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 And then I go under my I go in with um, to contour my face. I use the Fenty Beauty uh, Mocha Match Sticks. This I think this is a foundation, to be honest, like a stick foundation. But it works awesome for contour. So, you could contour your nose, nose, nose. I'm not really supposed to, I'm not trying, I mean, no. And then I'm just gonna put it under. I'm not too picky again, as I said, today. And then I go with the hula. Blend it in. For the under eye, if you have really wrinkly or um, creasy, like you notice your concealer creases a lot, you don't use um, a powder. Um, I know it's like all the rage to bake, you know, but it depends on what kind of skin you have. And I have a lot of creasing that happens when I use under eye powder, the loose powder, translucent powder under my eyes, and it makes it worse rather than better. So I stay away from using at least too much or baking. I don't really bake under my eyes because it makes it worse. Well, that's optional. Okay. 
I'm gonna just apply it all over my neck. Okay, so this is where I go in with my translucent powder. Where is it? I use the peach, um, my like tart or Too Faced Peach Perfect, and this has. Oh, it smells amazing. Like it smells so good. I love it. And I just put it wherever I didn't put the hula bronzer. So. Like pretty much everywhere just so it doesn't have that oily finish it has like more like a matte finish and then you can always like apply it everywhere and then just put more bronzer on top i don't really care my hair is a total mess i took a bath yesterday or showered my hair yesterday and I wake, I wake up like, I woke up like this. <laughs> okay. So that's pretty much what I do for my face. I will go in again with my hula. My foundation is a little bit too white too, just because I moved. Florida and I haven't been able to film anymore. But it's okay. Okay, for today I'm just gonna put eyeliner on. I usually don't, but I will. Good, why not? My eyes look so much bigger with eyeliner. Okay. And then I will take my eyeshadow and of course I always go for neutrals, everybody knows that. So I'm just gonna apply it all over, all over. Again, I'm not a pro, I'm a mama. I need to go pick up my kids, they have a dentist appointment. So that's what I'm doing. Like I mix up and then like this. So I like make sure it stays up. And... Okay, I'm gonna use some eyeliner. Oh, I might, I use the just peachy. I put eyeliner and mascara on, as you can see. And then I will go in with a neutral lippy um i am using which one should i use i'll use the kylie um punk and then i don't go in with too much so it's kind of dark and then i go in with a light one this is the nyx lingerie oh uh Dry up and won't move. Then I get a piece of toilet paper or any kind of paper you have that's dry. And then I just take off the excess. Excess, excess, excess. Oh no. Okay. And that's it. That's my makeup. I still have to do this hair. But that is pretty much. Oh yeah, I forgot blush. I guess I can just put it on. I just put blush on right on, like this is where it contoured, as you can kind of see. So I just put it on top, but not all the way. And then on top of that, I'm gonna use my MAC. Um, this is the soft and gentle. And then what I do is I just get some with my, oh, I usually do my ring, my, not the ring finger, yeah, this finger. I'll use my middle finger right now. And then I just, you see where it's already like highlighted on its own? I just go in 
right there and I just press and then I just right there and then I go right here mm -hmm. on top of her lip a little and then that's it and then I go in and I don't like I don't personally don't like it to be too harsh so I just up under like 10 minutes so i hope you guys like this video tutorial whatever if you guys like it let me know i'll do more